These videos dominate as one of the most watched niches on social media, with each one racking up millions of views. I have six eggs. Right, okay. I broke two. You broke two. I cooked two. You cooked two. I ate two. And you ate two. Yeah, so how many are left? Right, listen again. These videos are a perfect example of combining humor and valuable information. It's no coincidence that these clips are generating thousands of dollars through platforms like the TikTok Creativity Program, YouTube AdSense, or paid sponsorships. First, let me show you how to create a unique Stickman character. Start by going to Google and search for Adobe Express Animate. To save you time, I've included all the relevant links in the description below, so make sure to check them out. Once you're on the site, Go to the Character tab and scroll down until you find the character named Sticky. Then, navigate to the Background tab and change it to a solid black color. After that, upload any audio file so the character can lip-sync to it. Finally, find a frame where the arms and legs are hidden, leaving only the head and body visible, and take a screenshot. The next step is to open a new project in Canva. I'm going for a square layout, so once you're finished setting this up, you start by uploading the screenshot you just took. Now use the Background Remover tool to delete the black background. If you're using Canva's free version, note that the Background Remover is a pro feature, but no worries if you aren't one. Because when you go to this website, you can accurately remove the background for free. Now back in Canva, start by duplicating the image in order to create two separate layers. Then resize one layer leaving only the head visible, and resize the other layer so that just the body is visible. Next, select the body layer and move it slightly upward to close the gap between the head and body, just like this. Moving forward, you need to cover the eyes and mouth, which can simply be done by implementing a square, make it the same color as the body, and position it over the eyes to create a blank face. Next, go to Elements and select a circle. Make sure to make it transparent, then click here and increase the border weight to about 10 to 15, leaving just the outline visible. Now watch closely and be precise because you're going to resize the circle so that it perfectly fits the head. Take your time with this and just play around until you think it fits nicely. Now that the outline is done, it's time to go full Bob Ross mode. Head over to the pencil tool and carefully draw the body's outline. This step requires patience and precision, so make sure to take your time with this. Once the body outline is complete, the next thing you need to do is adding lines because this is the part where you're going to give your character some arms and legs. Again, with this part, don't rush it. Place the arms and legs evenly for a balanced look. After positioning everything, group all the elements together like this. And yes, that's basically all you need for creating the base of a customizable Stickman character. But to make it more interesting, I added this hat as a final touch in order to give the character a little more personality. Yes, this looks pretty dope. Now that the Stickman character is finished, the next step is to download it. Once that's done, what you need to do next is upload the character into Photoshop and watch closely. First, navigate to the Quick Selection tool, highlight the body, group it like this, and then click Solid Color. This lets you change the body color to any color you want. If you don't have Photoshop, no problem. Upload the character into PhotoP instead. Here, use the magic wand tool, select the body, group it, and then click color fill. Just like in Photoshop, you can now customize the color to whatever you like. Now, for the final step, return to Canva. Begin by adding a mouth to the character and carefully positioning it on the head to ensure a precise fit. Next, add the eyes, adjusting their size slightly to achieve the right proportions. Take your time to arrange these features correctly, ensuring they align well and contribute to a balanced and polished overall appearance for the character. To animate this character, type in Meta Animated Drawings in Google and click on this link to access the platform, which is free to use. In here, upload your character, click Next, and by doing so, the tool will analyze your character and attempt to identify its structure automatically. In the next step, the tool highlights the character for further adjustments. Ensure that the detection fully covers the character. Once you're satisfied, move to the final step, where you'll need to mark the character's joints. Carefully align the markers with the corresponding joints on the character. If the initial placements are not accurate, adjust them to ensure precise animation. After completing the joint adjustments, click Next once more. The tool will take a few seconds to animate your character. Once the process is complete, you'll be presented with a variety of animations to choose from. These include categories such as dancing, comedic movements, jumping, and walking. Select the animations that best fit your needs because you're going to use them for creating a Stickman character video. Here's ye, ye.
the top of top of the Yo, what's up, guys? Yo, what's up, Kev? What's up? What are y'all talking about? Bro, this guy just now told me he made over 10K last night. Seriously? Are you for real? Yeah, bro. Nah, stop the cap. Kev, it's true he just showed it to me. He isn't lying. But even how did you do that? Gee, to be honest, I don't even know, bro. I was just like chilling in my room with some pure broccoli, if you know what I mean, right? <laughs> and, uh... Dude, get straight to the point. What he mean is, yesterday he saw a video of some guy making big cash on this website, Pump Fun. Pump Fun, bro? What kind of website is that even? Yeah, so on this website you can make meme coins really easy, and basically I decided to make this coin pure broccoli, and somehow people started to buy that thing. No way. Is it really that easy? You need to teach me this, bro. Teach what? I literally just told you. I just made a coin with no purpose, and people started to buy that coin. I don't even know.